Hi, my name is Jim Mayfield. I'm CEO of Setsi Systems. And we're here today to talk about Aquaticar. This is a brand new ride system that we've developed. That we've taken the theme park type storytelling ride experience into a water park. And how we do this is with Aquaticar. This vehicle dry loads with the guests. The canopy opens. We have guests enter the ride on a conveyor system. Once loaded, at the end of the conveyor, transitions to a gravity descent ramp. And then we enter this fully themed aquatic environment where we're telling a story. In this case, we're going back into a lost city that not only has its discoveries of buildings and structures, but also a few surprises. As it's traveling over approximately 110 meters, we have an antenna that's above the surface and it's triggering optical sensors. Those optical sensors, they're triggering di different special effects, whether it's sound inside the canopy or maybe it's special effects out in, in the uh, environment. But all along the course, it's interactive as the car is passing through these themed, these themed environments. We also have bubble curtains so that as we pass from one themed environment to the next, the vehicle passes through a wall of bubbles so you're able to unveil these new themed environments. The Quadra car is the first time where you'll see storytelling in a water park environment. Yep. Can you tell us why, why it was important to design something uh, with a storytelling component in a water park? Well, our history, our company has been, our mission is really all about innovation and how do we get guests underwater, non-divers, people who have never really experienced the underwater world. That's our passion. We started with Sea Trek and Snuba and a lot of other various products, submersibles, semi-submersibles. Everything was designed to get non-divers, non-swimmers underwater to enjoy something that we're so passionate about. Sea Trek was really the antithesis of this. Sea Trek, though, you're in an individual helmet, so you're not able to really share the experience with the person that you're with. This, you have two people aboard, you're able to talk about it, and it's amazing. You can whisper to each other in the density of water, you can hear each other so, so plainly. So that was really how this began was from Sea Trek. We wanted to expand that into something that could be shared. You look at most people who never have an opportunity to explore underwater, so what a great opportunity to actually explore underwater, not have to know how to swim. You're just seated in this vehicle and you're being taken on this journey. The first system is uh, partially delivered, will be fully delivered in early uh, first quarter of next year, but it will be operated in, uh, in Saudi Arabia near Riyadh. Okay, wow, that's exciting. So that'll be a 17 car system, 300 guests per hour capacity. Wow. About a four and a half minute underwater ride experience. Okay, so I didn't realize that. So the first installation is already planned. Oh, it's, it's uh, well under construction. Wow. Yes. Okay.